My specialty practice that I received from my master, my master transmit energy to me. And after that, when I started to teach, I actually I transmit energy to people. For me, when I study with my master, I don't believe it because uh, before I met my master, I never can feel chi. <laughs> so after I study with my master, when he transmit energy to me, I suddenly said, I feel chi. <laughs> I feel energy. Uh, I feel energy running in my body. I feel energy. I can transmit energy. So I feel energy. And uh, when I can feel it, I have it. The whole key is very simple. I have it. I can transmit it to you. I don't have it. I don't know how to give you. I have nothing to give you. My teaching is I have it. I give you. I don't have it. I cannot give you anything. You know? I have doing this transmitting energy to help people for nearly 50 years. 50 years of practice and working and helping people. The transmitting online, I developed this uh, scene on the COVID, I developed it. Now in a mobile telephone, we can talk to anybody <laughs> in this world, okay? <laughs> or even into the moon. If people go up and broadcast in the moon, we can talk to anybody. So that means we are interconnecting together. When we have Love, we know that love can radiance, okay? When you started to learn how to shining and radiant out your love out, and when you started to understand that love can be expanding, or a message, because we are all connecting together. When a boss cousin, it's the same theory. So when you develop this love, joy, happiness, radiant out, and when we develop in the mid eyebrow and forehead, it's very important, developing the four, mid eyebrow and forehead, and we call the soft hand. When you learn how to charge energy in the fingers, training fingers and the hand. And if you, walk, if you train longer, you started to learn how to charge and store energy in the bones. So when you make the bones big and long, extend up to the universe and hollow. Okay, so we only charge the arm up to the shoulder. So we always block the shoulder. So when you charge the chi in the bone, bone have a lot of chi. And when you charge them, they have more chi. And when you need to use it, you can use them. So that's why a training of how to activate the bone and bone marrow and store chi in the bone and bone marrow. And all this chi can use for healing, can use for healing yourself, healing other people, or maintain a uh, protecting shield, maintain a good energy around you. Uh, it's a training. So um, in the Tao practice that I inherit from my master is energy training. They have a fixed pattern, fixed formula and practice. When I charge, I charge enough chi in my, in my bones and up to the shoulder. So I know that I'm fully charged. For example, I feel that I need more uh, when I know that, okay, we have more online, more people. So I charge more chi in here. So when I charge enough chi, Chi in the universe is unlimited, but we limit it. We limit it when we're not trained. But when you train your bone, bone can be expand very big. So bone can be hollow. So when I, when I, when I train, I extend my hand, my fingers, and my arm bone only. And I, bone can be extended. So I extend the bone very long, very long, very long, very big, extend up to the universe. So if we are charging the water, so we call the heavenly pool. So you extend it, connecting with the heavenly pool, we call the heavenly water, and you charge the water on your bones, okay? And uh, another one we call the fire, so we call the sacred fire. Some people call that like the holy fire. So the sacred fire, you can charge them in the bone, okay? So you charge all the sacred fire in the bone 
and it gives you the qi, the, the, the firepower. When you're transmitting it, usually we're transmitting out. So I have all these bones are charged with energy. It's just like I'm charging in here and I can releasing this energy that I charge from the heaven into the, uh, into the camera and to the boss casting. Okay. The energy in the universe is have a certain uh, density itself. You have no way to pack too much or too thin. But the bone, when you, when you charge them in, when you said, I want to finish charging this bone for this much. And now uh, usually, uh, I like to know that how many people usually. So when we go to one certain level, I need more power. I ask more. For me, after these few years, because uh, COVID changed everything, okay? So I never think about uh, this kind of uh, transmitting online. But for the report that coming back from the student, so sometimes we ask them and their feedback, that is quite an, uh, a great big number. In the percentage, I think it's 60, 70 percent. The people feel the energy. I don't think anything in this world you can say 100 percent. Okay, but the mean for me, 60, 60 percent, 70 percent is quite a lot. And though people not getting it, if they continue practice, practice, they get it. So that the percentage is quite high. Some people pick up in the first session. Some people might pick up in the second or the third or they're repeating it, or repeating it. We subscribe one, and that practice will be on a link in the, in the website. You can always click on that day and rewatch them again. And when you do it, the energy is still replay. So I find out that energy can be recording and replaying it 